Oh, here we are. We're at Stonehenge and it's blowing again. We're Come up. back to look round the stones and yeah. weather. We came the other day and it was lashing down with rain and uh, Storm Barrow was going through. So we've come back for another look and we're, we're, we're parked in this huge car park. Um, I'll show you, um, turn the camera around in a second. On the way to Burford, um, we're on the way to Burford. So we've stopped, uh, stopped off and I've parked the motorhome with the car uh, on right at the back of this huge car park. I'll show you. There we are, a bit of a job to see with the sun shining. A beautiful bright morning this morning. Um, but uh, the visitor centre is over there in the distance to the right. And this is the large car park. There is one other van parked in here. Um, do check with the site though as to whether you can park motorhomes. I mean the bays are quite good, the roads are quite wide, so I wouldn't have thought there'd been a problem. But uh, we've, cro we've parked crossway so I haven't got to detach the car and we're going to go over to uh, the visitor centre and then up to Stonehenge which is uh, tucked away over there on the hill. Uh, quite looking forward to this. As I say, came a couple of days ago and it was so wet that we thought we just had to come back for another bite. Large exhibition centre here. So it's just going down to the entrance. And just on the right hand side there's the uh, toilets and facilities. So we're gonna we're gonna go in and check in. Some burial mounds over there in the distance. Just been uh, on the bus here. We're walking up this nicely made up path up to the stones. Well, here we are at Stonehenge. Again. Sue said again because she came the other day time. when it was pouring rain. Robin, I like the way the birds sit on the top of the stones. Yeah. A bird Gives you a little bit of perspective. And just round to the right is the A303 which runs through Wiltshire so it gives you an idea of where we are quite an amazing quite an amazing sight Hmm. 
So if you're wondering where the uh, dry campers, the wild campers park when they uh, want to see Stonehenge, it's along this lane here and I can see what, two, four, six, eight, ten, probably a dozen vans down there. And there was a few a little further down the lane as well. A map of the site here. And the landscape of the Stonehenge area. You can walk to Stonehenge. We've just been on the bus. You follow the path. Let's can have a little look at these houses. back of the visitor centre here there's a shop on the right hand side really nice little shop and a little picnic area and a school party uh, sitting there and this end is the museum we'll go in there I'll take a few still shots in there in a moment we're going to come and have a look around at these houses here Sue's gone over, she's making herself at home. <laughs> Let's go and have a little look. This, uh... Just about to fit underneath. Morning. Hello. <laughs> they look very small, Sue. The beds didn't look very comfortable, Trev. They look very small, don't they? Let's have a little look. They must have got something else on You've got to dip your head to get in. They must have had a fire in the middle here, do you reckon? Just wait for the camera to adjust. Oh, here we are. Possibly there we a are. Fire. And a little uh, and cone shaped fits. roof here. Look at that. Yeah, must have been a fire in the middle here, it's as you say. shelves for their crockery and food, I expect. Isn't it just a window? Isn't it just a window? Yeah, it's just a window. No chimney, no. Yeah, we recently went in the Hebridean hut, didn't we? And they oh. made a fire without a chimney. Smoky though. Yeah, this was locked the other day, so couldn't get in. Yeah. This is nice. And I wonder if this is the bed. Yeah, there's two of them, aren't there? Yeah. Perhaps they sat there. Mm. Yeah, it's not very big. No. A knotted straw here. It's like an early thatch, very... isn't it? It is almost like a thatch, isn't it? Because yeah, so... if you look at that, that looks like a thatch. Back out in the bright sunlight now. It's a beautiful day today. Mm. And this is a smaller one. You can't get inside that one. It's a wood store. Sue's being nosy. Yeah, I think this is like a wood like a wood store, this one. How is it? Oh, very good. <laughs> Looking through keyholes. A little bit more upmarket this one, is it? Let's have a look inside. A little bit, a little bit more. Look, there's oh, yeah. still, still quite cosy, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Mm. They use a moss as well, aren't they, in the roof? Yeah, it looks or like no, it's moss. It's like, no, it's not. It's bits of straw, isn't it? Yeah. It was very effective at keeping the rain out the other day. Can you move the stone? And 
and here's the stone in question. Oh, a big one. Trying to give the rope a pull, Sue? Gotta pull harder than that. <laughs> Not going anywhere. Okay. Well, we've come back to the cafe. We were here a couple of days ago. It's very quiet today. Midweek. Uh, Sue's over there getting her um, milk for her tea. What you got today, Sue? I've got a rock cake. I've decided not to go for the Neolithic mince pie again. Oh, we had that yesterday. I'll put a picture in here. Day before yesterday. Day before yesterday. <laughs> I'll put a picture in here. Oh, hang on. So, so we're cake. now going to have a look and see what Sue's got in her bag. Rock cake. A rock cake. <laughs> Is that a Stonehenge rock? Looks like it. <laughs> Stonehenge rock. Okay, I've got uh, green tea. Sue's got normal tea and I've just gone for a bag of um, birds. She heard my voice. Hey? You heard my voice, didn't you? Hey? You were sound asleep. <laughs> Let's go around the other side. Just going to take them for a little uh, comfort break on the grass. <laughs> All right. Hey kids. Good. In their little fenced off area. Yeah. Well that's about it from Stonehenge. Was it worth it? Yes, it's lovely. I think it was worth it. We are National Heritage members so we Sunshine. can get in for free on our membership. But I'll put the prices, uh, um, the normal prices on screen here so you can see for yourself. We think it's great value. I mean, there's a big new visitor centre there. It must have cost an arm and a leg. Um, lots of Shuttle really every five minutes. Yeah, really friendly staff. A nice visit, weren't it? Lovely. The not sun's all, gone in now. Not at all disappointed. Yeah, and lovely. we had our photograph taken as well, oh. didn't we? So I'll put those pictures on screen right at the end. We're um, leaving Stonehenge now, aren't we? And we're going to Burford, Burford. in the Cotswolds. So we'll, um, when we're meeting a special friend there. Yeah. So we'll see you in the next video. Thanks very much for watching. Bye. Bye bye now. <laughs>